festival in India and right now I am sitting in what could be a flying air taxi two to three years down the line and to talk to us about that more we have the management of the company, the e-plane company with us. Many thanks for joining us Thank you here. So much. Tell us about this product, what is it and when can this turn into reality? Right. Uh, so my name is Vishnu. Uh, so what you are just coming out of is a mock-up of uh, what we call a flagship product which is the E200, uh, which is essentially a vehicle that will carry 200 kgs, right? It could be passengers uh, or cargo. Uh, so the aim of the company or the e-plane company is to be able to build an, a two-seater electric flying taxi, right? So just how you, the, the Olas and the Ubers of the world, you have uh, uh, product categories like you have the XL or the Go and things of that sort. We want to try and see if we can put this as a product category in itself, right? So a lot of the Arab countries, you can book a helicopter, right? So we're trying to make sure that this is available to you on an app-based uh, platform that you can book. It will, the, the end goal is to try and see if, we can, if this can come to your terrace before it can take you to your destination. Well, the Drone Festival of India has seen over 1,600 delegates coming forward for this event where they are showcasing products in the fields ranging from agriculture to defense, e-commerce and logistics. Healthcare delivery as well as the last mile connectivity is also one of the major focus areas in the products that have been displayed here. Garuda Aerospace would manufacture 1 lakh Kisan drones by 2023. We are very, very firmly on the way. By end of 2022, we should uh, manufacture about 25,000 drones. Uh, we are actually in the process of raising our Series A funding of $30 million. Uh, we are currently the most valuable drone startup in India at $250 million valuation. What you're seeing in the backdrop, Hermes 900, we are producing almost 20 per year but we can scale up the production almost to 50 per year going forward on the civil side the requirement is much huge and the good part is now we have signed up with general aeronautics as a partner which is focused on agri based drones and bringing ai ml technology in that and this afternoon i was discussing with the founder that how can we actually get, uh, give 6000 drones to india in the next 12 months well, the drone festival of india has seen participation of over 80 companies the drone industry is expected to reach a turnover of 15000 crore rupees by 2026 and there are over 270 indian startups into drone manufacturing currently right now here there are hundreds of youngsters who have come from different parts of the country to know more about drones and for that, we have here Akin, who is an engineering student. He has taken up drone flying as a side hobby and he will now teach me how to fly one.